So we did like a session on being a better friend and friend qualities and it just made me more mindful of what I do for my friends and how I respond to them in different situations and making sure that I have those qualities for them and myself. People don't talk about it enough and things like depression, they're not considered normal when they should be because they are normal and lots of people have to go through that. Yeah. I think, yeah, mental health is a taboo subject and I think it should be as normal like, like to talk about as physical health. Everybody feels this and it's normal to feel this, it's okay to feel this, like your feelings are valid but you just need to know when and how yeah. you can help yourself. Yeah. I guess, I guess I used to think that you, emotions were the things to be controlled, like you had to get rid of them or change them or like mould them into something else, but you don't. Like sitting with them is something that like I didn't realise was a way of dealing with it. Like I thought you just had to not feel a certain way or feel happy immediately. And it's quite hard sometimes if you're stressed or sad to like just immediately get rid of that so yeah. just don't, don't don't judge people by what they look like or what they seem to be because people aren't going to want to open up to you and tell you about who they actually are if you immediately assume that they're perfect I guess <laughs> um, when we were learning about suffering we watched a video, but then people can talk about their experiences of seeing people suffer, and that helps you understand it more. I'd also say with the class discussions I wrote on the form that I found those really helpful because it's like mindfulness, a lot of people will just think it's like sitting with yourself and in your emotions, which it partly is. But also, hearing everybody out in the classes gives you a sense of like togetherness as well as being at one with yourself. But like, ev everyone in the class is going to be different but also the same. And to hear everyone's opinions on everything you talk about just kind of builds sort of connection and understanding of people. Just that sort of acknowledgement that it's okay to have feelings and you know, there aren't good feelings or bad feelings, they just are, and, and, and that actually could be quite, um, I think, quite reassuring for a lot of them, because they sort of don't feel that they necessarily need to deal with them or squash them, it's just that, that, that they, they exist, um, and they've been a bit more open in talking about the way that they're feeling, which I think has been really good. They're much more able to sort of say, I'm, I'm not having the best of days or this has happened and so just that kind of maturity that's come into it that they're a bit more able to um, yeah to identify how they're feeling because I think before a lot of them hadn't really done that.